Hi, today we're going to make some yummy whole wheat carob zucchini muffins. These muffins are a sweet breakfast or snack option but are healthier than traditional muffins. Let's take a look at the recipe. So here in a bowl uh, we have uh, one and three quarter cups of whole wheat flour. To this we're adding one and uh, one third cup of light brown sugar. To this we're adding uh, two thirds of a cup of carob powder. We're adding one teaspoon of baking powder, one teaspoon of baking soda, and half a teaspoon of salt. We're gonna mix everything together. And the brown sugar here is a little lumpy, so I'm just gonna use my hands to get in there and get the lumps out. Now we'll move on to our wet ingredients. So for our wet ingredients, uh, we're going to uh, use an egg replacer as, an, as a substitute for two large eggs. I generally use the Energy brand of egg replacer um, and this calls for, uh, for two eggs, it calls for three teaspoon of the egg replacer powder mixed with four, four tablespoons of warm water. Um, and because I'm using whole wheat flour, I'm going to add an extra teaspoon of water here. So we're just going to mix, whisk this together until it forms a foamy mixture. And my daughter is going to help me here. You might have also seen me in our welcome video. So to this uh, egg, egg replacer, we're going to add one cup of very finely grated zucchini. I use the smallest uh, hole for grating this. So we're going to add that and we're give it a mix. Yes, we are going to give it a mix. Like this. Add three quarter of a cup of milk. About a teaspoon of vanilla extract. Uh, you can start to smell the good smells. So to this mixture, we're going to add half a cup of butter. Butter that's been melted. We'll give it a good mix. And then we'll mix our wet ingredients into our dry. And so now we're going to pour our uh, wet ingredients into our dry ingredients. We're just going to mix this until everything is incorporated. We don't want to over mix this. We just want to... Uh, make sure that all the dry ingredients are mixed in well with the wet oh, ingredients. So okay, so our batter is is mixed now. We're gonna now put this into it, our muffin it. pan. Okay, so here we have lined a muffin pan with no, muffin right. cups, and we're just gonna fill the muffin pans with our batter. Uh, you wanna help me? Which one? All of them. Okay. So we're going to bake this in the preheated oven for about 20 minutes. Um, but everybody's oven is different, so I would check this at around 15 minutes. Basically, we just want to make sure that when a toothpick is inserted in the center, it comes out clean. So these have just come out of the oven. It's been about, uh, it's been 20 minutes. I'm just going to insert a toothpick. It's come out clean. So these are done. So we'll let it cool for about 10-15 minutes before taking them out. And of course I couldn't wait that long to show you how it looked inside. These warm fluffy muffins are a sweet treat for anyone. And the fact that they have zucchini and whole wheat and carob inside is a secret. Shh. So please give this recipe a thumbs up if you like it. If you want to see more of these kinds of recipe, please do subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.